Okay, so I'm back. I am doing a quick review on the shower oil. Now, this is not my first time using the shower oil. Again, when back in end of September, I was on my way out of town. I was just saying to myself um, that I wanted to go to L'Occitan to pick me up some um, a milk bar. And I'm on my way out of town, and the store is right across from my gate. So I stopped, got my milk bar, which um, I've been using this since. I bought this at the end of September. So I've been using it ever since I got it. And as you can see, because the bar is so huge, I use this at least twice a day, um, every day. And you can see it still look like a regular bar of soap would you get out the store, which I'm the only one that uses this. So it's going to last me probably another couple of months um, before I have to even open my other one. And with me having my shower oil, too, it'll just last. But I picked up, she gave me this size bottle. I think it came in like a, um, like a sample bag type of thing that um I think she gave it to me for free. I'm not sure. I know I had a bag that she gave me. But um I really didn't assess it at that time. I just know it smelled good and then she gave me a little sample bottle of oil. It was real small. And so I knew if I felt my body felt good after um using it and putting it on but um wanting to do a review on this shower oil i said let me really sit back and see how this feels you know um after i shower so that's what i did today with this and i want to say this uh, is really nice. It really does hydrate the skin after you shower. And what I did was I scrubbed, exfoliated my body with the almond um, bar because y'all know this is all I told you the same line. So it smells just like this, just like the butter that I got after I did that and washed myself down because this bar does give a lot of suds. So after you scrub yourself down, I used my washcloth and had it in my washcloth and just went all over my body. I don't did not use this down below and I do not use this down below. I have a uh, totally separate soap that I use down below and I also don't use the same washcloth down below as I use on the rest of my body. So let's get that straight. I just don't. Um, <laughs> so uh, after I exfoliated my body and washed myself down, I went behind it one time with the shower oil and I will say it leaves the skin soft, hydrated, is not dried out. Um, I know where I live, the water is very, very harsh. I need to get me a filter um, to put on my shower head. But um, I like it. Now, the one thing I will say about it is that you can use a lot at one time. I'm heavy-handed, so... Uh, but the good thing about it, too, is that it's not expensive to get a bigger bottle. Um, I do have a bigger bottle. I don't have it on me. I just squeezed it into this bottle because I'm traveling, which is more than enough, you know, um, for you to travel with that it gets you through. You know, um, if not, just bring another soap. But um, I did squirt a good amount onto my rag and went over all of my body and my body just felt nice. It, you know, it's not slick, you know, a greasy feeling. It still is a uh, soap. <laughs> it has a really light lather. It does not lather um, heavy, and it does come out as an oil until you wet it, and then you get a milky lather. You know, a really nice one, light, but will clean you. Y'all, I smell so good. Um, so. I don't know, there's nothing more that I could say. Like this line right here is really good. And on top of that, if you don't like 
this scent. They do have other shower oils, I believe, in different fragrances. I'm just always been a sucker for anything almond, coconut, um, anything like that. I'm not a huge flower, um, you know, scent person and or perfumey. I can't do too much perfumey because it bothers my nasal allergies. I have really bad nose allergies and um, it'll just inflame my nostrils like no tomorrow even when i was in there testing like different creams and stuff it drove me mad like i told my daughter i said i need to go somewhere and wash my hands because certain creams like they smell good but i know certain scents will not agree with my nose um on a long period of time <laughs> so i was so happy when i was able to wash my hands and just get the sense of some of those uh, hand, some of those creams, they weren't even hand creams. They was regular body creams off of my hands, but this don't bother me. So I absolutely love it. It will stay in my arsenal of my cleansers to use on my body because there's not a whole lot that I can use that don't, you know, break me out, you know, and stuff like that. So I would say... It's a thumbs up. Thumbs up. You can't go wrong with this. If you want to get something off, off the ground uh, that has good ingredients, works, you know, um, does not uh, give a negative reaction for people that have uh, skin issues. Um, my mom told me about this with my sister. She would get a lot of boils and stuff like that. And, you know, just like um, sensitive skin. And that's how I came across L'Occitane. Because uh, my mother, she was like, that stuff is really good. And she used it on my sister and herself. And so I was like, y'all know the product junkie in me, especially at the time. I've always been a sucker for Bath and Body products just couldn't use them because I would break out Bath and Body Works. I couldn't use that stuff. I would break out within like two days of using it. Um, body, body, uh, what is it? The Body Store or something like that. They had an, another um, like almond coconut scent uh, that I loved in their cream. After a couple of days of using that, again, I would start breaking out, so I would have to leave it alone. So there wasn't a whole lot that I could use. <clears throat> but um, when my mother told me about this, I was like, especially that verbena bar, um, you know, just exfoliating your skin very well without it being harsh. And the bar ain't nothing but about this long. And about, it's not even as thick as that almond bar. It's probably about this thick. And it's a um, in the shape of a leaf. So depending on how many times you use it, you you know you're not going to get a whole lot of uses out of it. It is a soap. It's a small soap, and um, it's five dollars a bar for the, if you like the verbena scent. But at the time that I knew of, that was the only exfoliating bar that I knew about because that's what my mom told me about. But it worked. And again, it's not harsh at all. Yeah, you do feel a little scrubby things. But for people like myself with sensitive skin, I can't use all those harsh scrubs and stuff because it'd be done scratch me all up. I'd be red. So I have to be careful. But it worked. And she also told me about the milk bar as well and the verbena bar. Again, they have this in the verbena scent. I don't like the verbena scent. They have actually more scents now. Uh, and also for men too. Um, but, you know, if you don't like the scent of this shower gel, shower oil, they do have other shower oils. You don't have to go with exactly this one, but I'm assuming that they all work the same. So, get down to L'Occitane. And another thing about L'Occitane, too, if you don't have a store where you live, order online and they give you $20 off your first order. 
I don't know if it have to be a certain amount, but shoot, $20. Ain't nobody give you $20 off your first order. They barely want to give you 10%, but they give you $20 off your first order. So if you don't have a Loxetin, order online, $20 off and just, you know, once you know what you like, but I do, I will say find a store because this way you can sniff everything. They have testers out. Some of them even have sinks where you can use the soaps and stuff and wash your hands with it and see how it feels. Um, not all the stores have sinks, some of them, but yeah. So um, this is over 10 minutes. I'm going to go. Y'all have a happy new year. Uh, new year. Have a safe New Year's Eve. Um, and we, may we march on into 2020 with uh, bigger and better things and y'all help me get this dang on watch hours because uh it's moving slow slow i have a little bit over 400 hours left to get help us sister out peace